nice to meet you. It's your pleasure. I'm going to embarrass myself with a bunch of things for you to sign. Oh, That's okay. okay. No worries. I'm trying to remember who all these people were. Where was that? It was in Vegas. Oh, no, down in Venice Beach. by Muscle Beach. Why was I... Oh, I know why. I was... Um, I filmed a movie called The Hustler in Muscle Beach. Yeah. With Kay Lynn. Ah. And uh, while I was down there, all the... You know, they were having a muscle building contest right. as part of the show. Right. So I think that's exactly what happened. That's yeah. why I'm dressed up like that. Okay. Because I'm, I'm a promoter hustler from New York exactly. trying to make my way. Okay, you're on top of that. Of course, I remember all of this. My God, my little house. Well, I'm actually I'm the, an editor of a teen magazine now. It's how I make my living. So I wanted to ask you a little bit about like what that kind of what that era was like when they were doing all these things with you. And was it was it a strange thing? Was it? God, I remember that house. I lived there for many, 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 many years. Oh, so you? It was your house? Because sometimes they fake those. No, it's two houses. I had a house and a guest house. And uh, the guy that lives in this house, believe it or not, a uh, famous actor too. I can't think of his name. But a very famous actor. He starred on a couple of television shows and uh, all that good stuff. Anyway, yeah, I lived there for, I owned this house for like 15 years, 20 years before I sold it. I just sold it maybe in 2000, bought it in 78, and I sold it in 2002. So they're in a good time then. Yeah. So. Tell you something. The energy it takes to maintain a body like that is the same energy it takes to be successful in anything in life. It's just the question is, do you want to put all your time into being in a gym, which that takes a lot of energy to, to work out hours and hours and hours a day to have that. But nobody can keep that up for very long. So they do it for five, ten years maybe at the most. And then if you see those guys ten years later, twelve years later, fifteen years later, you know, it's like... You give up. Recently, not you, recently no. But you also have to see how long well, they for, live. For quite a while, though. Yeah. Well, because you yeah. the acting business, so and now. Where do you want me to sign it? Anywhere? Like, yeah, right there, I think. Because oh, then okay. when I put it together, it'll be. To Matt, again? Yes, please. Actually, a lot of movies and various things, but I'm directing, I've been directing projects, I, I write, I teach and lecture all over the country. I just taught three days at the University of Mexico, uh, down in Mexico City, which is down there. Um, do you want me to, you're, I was on streets during this time, do you want me to put streets in San Francisco? No, that's okay. Nothing? Okay. Yeah, I've never been into that for some reason, like the, putting the name and all that.
You got Jane Seymour for a whole episode before she got shot in the back. Yeah. And then you got stuck with her kid and this damn dog. But oh my god. <laughs> so you really got screwed. Everybody put Foxy box under their wing. And then he had Marin Jensen staring at him all the time going, uh, yeah, Red like Spang needs to get her ass in one of these things. I haven't seen her in a while and she was so freaking hot. Yes, the she was a lovely, such a, uh, such a lovely, lovely lady. Is